But uh, so yesterday, uh, it looks like the stream was very choppy. And I didn't get any warnings on my stuff that it was choppy. So I changed some settings and hopefully it'll fix it. But if anybody notices that it's being choppy, it should be smooth, extremely smooth, because that's what I'm seeing. I'm, I'm on an R9 3900X and an RTX 2080 Ti video card. So it's, it's not like I have the top of the line hardware or anything. Although it could be argued that a, a, a Intel processor would be a little bit faster. So here's the settings I run at. I can run at full settings, but I cannot stand terrain tessellation. It just, it, the way that they implemented it, it kind of blends in. And as you walk and look around, it, it seems to turn on and off. I can't stand it. So I have it off. That's standard. And then I backed off GTA O from ultra to high. This is, uh, ground truth ambient occlusion it's okay the ground can lie to me a little bit i have no idea what that means but uh to give the cp the gpu a little more room um otherwise i don't i don't know what the heck it is but i mean i've, I've seen i've played it all enhanced before uh, with a previous video card and it looked gorgeous you really can't tell and even all standard looks gorgeous you really can't tell um you know some of this stuff is just little detail that if you compared the pictures side by side you could maybe see a difference, but um, no, you don't need it. I like this card because I can, or I could, um, encode streaming video and save it to the disk at the same time without without it breaking a sweat. Excuse me, but um, apparently uh, something happened. So what is it I want to do? I got this new ch ship, chicken out. I don't know how happy I am with it. This this is weird. Um, so if you do, uh, if you do, somebody type in um, exclamation point game rules for me, would you? Because I have to tab out to do it. But um, I said I I can't buy any technology upgrades. Yeah, I cannot purchase any upgrade. Thanks. I cannot purchase any upgrade modules from space space station vendors. Only contraband or those I can get at the anomaly. I can use random rewards and those given from scrapping. So basically I am a persona non grata uh, at those technology merchants. I don't know. But yet I can get missions from the guys across the way. So it's not a perfect rule. <laughs> but, but I like the idea of contraband. So the upgrades I'm playing around with, uh, this ship needs to be upgraded now because I just got it. But in the exosuit I've got some, some wacky contraband upgrades. Illegal movement system upgrades clearly illegal and uh yeah i don't know the starship doesn't have anything the multi-tool sure has some illegal upgrades now this i got where did i get this i think i got this off of damaged machinery but i can also get stuff off the anomaly if the anomaly ever works for me now let's see it's a new day ah, i've lost connection to online discovery services so that problem persists and Best I can tell, it's not experimental mode, because I can switch over to non-experimental mode, and it's still dead. So anyway, I want to upgrade the ship a little bit. Um, I want to get some uh, some more pugnium. How much pugnium do I have? I have 64. I'd like to get some more. You get it from fighting sentinels, although I don't know how much. And this planet sure doesn't have any sentinels on it. So, what could we do? What could we do? Let's see. If I go over to the starship and I say, e Oh, I gotta make some fuel. Uh, salt. Uh, let's put this down here. Let's put this down here. Uh, I was watching KJPC Gaming, her latest uh, episode of uh, Permadeath. And. She's been taking to selling, see how much the salvage data is worth? Is to actually selling the salvage data early. Where I've never even considered that. But you can do two things with salvage data. You can, you can uh, uh, refine it into nanites, or you can just flat out sell it for a pretty good amount. I might have to start doing that, because digging up salvage data is pretty easy. Uh, navigation data can go down here as well. Perfect. Alright, what kind of upgrades can I add? Oh, I need the economy scanner. So I need uh, five microprocessors and a wiring loom. I think I can get that. Uh, the teleport receiver. 
I could make that. That helps a little bit. Um, hey, Lord Stork, how you doing? Thanks for stopping by. Good to see you. Let's make the teleport receiver. I got this. Uh, let me roll up an antimatter really quick. And there we go. And then, uh, what else do I want to make? I want to make the economy scanner. So let me duck inside here. And let's see. Do you have microprocessors? Oh. Wow. But remember, remember, I don't have to buy microprocessors anymore. Remember? That's right. I know how to make them. I need chromatic metal and carbon nanotubes. I need five of these, so I'm gonna need five carbon nanotubes. That is so that is such a great addition to the game. You used to have to run expanding the base quest and get fairly far into it before you got the recipe for microprocessors. Now they they give you a way not to have to run those quests if you don't want to. There are good reasons to run those quests because it gives you a lot of free technology and some of the free uh, plant recipes. Mm, how to grow plants. Mm, something like that. But um, yeah. Two, three, four, five. I have enough chromatic metal. Amazing. How much chromatic metal do I have? 1,844. You gotta love normal mode. I do have this cold shield that I picked up somewhere. Uh, now, what's interesting about this is you could these shields, these uh, hazard protection upgrades that are recharged, like this one, can only be bought at those technology merchants. All the other upgrades are just a percentage. Um, and I don't have like this one, heat resistance 21%. It gives you a percentage resistance, but it doesn't give you the shield like this one does. So I'm gonna have to find these. Uh, the same goes with uh, any ones you find like this are also just a percentage. I'm having a good day. It's a good day. It's supposed to rain today, but uh, right now it's it was fairly nice out. And there's a couple of two wild turkeys in the backyard again. They visit us like every three or four days. Uh, a big one and it looks like a little baby wild turkey. I keep telling them, you know, Thanksgiving's getting closer. But uh, no, we won't, we won't hurt our wild turkeys. What was I doing? You can see why. What was I doing? I was doing something. I was gonna make... Right. Keep staying here. I was gonna make the... Um, economy scanner. Yes, sir Bob. Not that one. I need a walker brain for that. The economy scanner. Ah, oh, I used up my only wiring loom. Alright. Let me buy some wiring loom. Wiring looms? Too bad you can't make wiring looms. You don't have any? Right, this guy does. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through. You, ha you have to have at least one wiring loom, right? Yeah, I'll purchase both of yours. 120 grand. Jeepers is all I can say. Uh, easy now, easy now. Economy scanner has been installed. Good. And did I want to buy this gun? What what cabinet? It's a B cabinet. Hmm. It's only 1.9 million. I'm rocking my little upgraded multi-tool now with one spot free. I'm not ready to buy this yet. I'm going to I'm going to look around a little more and see if I can find a better multi-tool before I commit to this one. And just the front door. Yeah, anything else? Let me have to head over here a minute. I thought I put something in storage container inventory. Check it out. The uh, batteries. Oh, I wonder how good so it's nighttime. How are the batteries working out? How much power we have left? We have plenty of power left. Look at that. 88%. Time until drain 6 hours. And what time is it in the day? There we go again. Is it going to do that every time? Um, it is 1.42am and the sun here rises about 4am. 
so that's plenty of time. All right. What do we got in here? I got this uh, underwater protection module, which is useless for now. Um, I put five wiring looms in here because of inventory space. All right, fine. And that's about it. I've got jazz, some Taz in here. I don't really need it. All right, let's uh, let's see. Uh, I believe I was storing these in high capacity. Yeah, cargo. Anything else I want to put in cargo? Anything that doesn't stack very high I want to put in cargo. No, we're good. I'm keeping the silver. We have three inventory spaces free. I really need more. Uh, I could build... How much... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. How much paraffinium do I have? That would be none. Mm-hmm. Well... All right, let's fly around. We'll go, where's the heading? Let's go south, just for a little bit. Pretty planet. I feel like I should get more more of those uh, data things. All right, I haven't been up here yet, so the game's gonna pause yet again for some reason. All right, uh, let's see. Discovered the Paradise Planet. Where else can I go? There's the space station. You're the Caustic Planet. There were a lot of buildings on this planet, though. But you're not complaining about... Um, all right. I want one that complains about high Sentinel activity. I would like... Actually, you know what? I would like to install some weapons. The technology on this thing is just crap. I want to install some weapon upgrades. Yeah, nonlinear optics. Hermetic seal. I got the wiring loom and the tritium. I just need two hermetic seals. Well, that's easy enough, don't you think? Um, two hermetic seals, please. And then let's go ahead and build that right here. All right, and then let's move from this here over to here. So now I have an upgrade for this heat dispersion plus 21%. That just fixes the cooldown, but it doesn't increase the damage. I'd really like some damage increase before I get into a fight, though it's not necessary. All right, let's, uh don't need to summon the anomaly there's no reason to the caustic was that all there is in this three there's one behind it that I forget what it is so let's just get out here a little bit if we warp we should get into freighter battle it should be the fifth warp I'd also like a ship weapon upgrade for that heading in the direction I want to head in. Got that rock. Alright, I should be able to see that other planet now. There it is. Erupting planet. Oh, that's right. But it doesn't have sentinels either. It's like this whole place is peaceful. Alright, the only solution is to go to the space station. And go to a different uh, system. I think I've scrapped all the ships I got. I believe. I'm gonna go to the other side. You know, space is so peaceful before the freighters start to show up. It really is. Do -do -do. 
do do do. Lost Maya, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Uh, no, I don't want to go to that side. I want to go to this side. Yeah, this is a this is a advanced economy, but all the explorers are just junk. All right, what do we got going on? Um, nude Barra platform. What is this? Uh, Gek, sustainable, four planets, two moons. Sure, I have no memory of this place. My speaker is crooked. I might not be experiencing ultimate, ultimate sound if my speaker is crooked. There, it's much better. Alright, you know what I could do after I get out of the tab menu is uh, what do we got going on? I haven't discovered any of these. This one is Starball, uh, the Xeno Colony. This one's the Storm Crystal Base, right? Right. Let's, let's check out the other planets. This is a cold planet, right? Magnetized ferrite. You know, one thing about normal mode is it's kind of difficult to find planets with high sentinel activity. And that that that's a little bothersome. See what I'm saying? This is a barren planet. Let's try it out. I haven't landed on it yet. We'll head in this general direction. I'm not saying I'm tempted to start over again in, like, survival mode, but let's face it. I'm going to continue this, though. We're just, we're just, I just need to uh, check out all the new stuff. It's Hacky Gamma. <laughs> oh, what's this? Is this something? That's yeah, nothing. It's nothing. Any buildings nearby? Just a quick perusal. We'll just land on this. Right up here. What do you say right up here? Nicely done. Alright, I've landed. We're here. It's very gray. No, brown and pink. So, do I have any take picture quests? Uh, log, industrial, take landscape photographs. Toxic world, blast. All right, well, do you hear that? Uh, any buildings nearby? Sentinels are remote again. Yeah. Not really looking for remote sentinels. It's a peaceful place. Let's go. Let's see what else this place has. Oh, it's a binary star system. Alright, we were there. There's a planet over here. Let's go this way. There it is. I think I might have gotten this one. Got that rock. That's the Xeno colony. Alright. And way, way, way up here. Up here. That's this is the cold one, right? Icy planet. And I've land unmapped. All right, well, we got to do it at some point. Let's just land on this one. You know... What's this one? Mag 
Metallurgic planet. Alright, let's give this one a try first. Sounds like more fun. At some point, again, you're not an object of interest. I'm just saying. I hit him. Well, now you're an object of interest. That's what you get for interrupting my pulse drive, dude. I'll be taking this. Get standing decreased. But I'll take the deuterium. All right, now no interruptions. I was on my way. I think it's BS though. I was shooting at the rock. Clearly, clearly I was shooting at the rock. Hey, Lost Moya, thanks. Appreciate it. Clearly, I was shooting at the rock. It seems to me they may have made normal mode just a little bit easier again. Maybe by accident. But uh, I remember when I started normal, the YouTube save for example, when I started normal mode, I had an aggressive sentinel planet in the starter system. And I would see one in just about every system. But now that pub Pugnium is a currency, where, oh, where are the aggressive systems? Well, this is an interesting color. Alright, uh, let's land up on one of these things. Got it. Uh, oh, there's a hole in the middle. We must be cautious. Here's the thing, even in normal mode, if you fell down there without a terrain manipulator, you'd be screwed. We won't fall. We'll go over here. Um, yeah, I mean, you could just restart. You can't save down there, so you just have to reload from save. Uh, so where are the Sentinels? Sentinels limited. No thanks, doggo. Alright. Yet another limited sentinel planet. Where else can we go? It's the, there's my base. Could be. I have a train manipulator, so I could just blast my way out too. All right, let's land on the cold planet. Although it's gonna want me to go to the space station. We'll, we'll re-aim when we get closer. How many do I still need to map? Going to the cold, and then we have this one that I haven't mapped yet. But that one's not that one's not a moon. I got the two moons. I got the two moons, Kessen and Oyabababo over Hacky Gamma. If if I want sentinels, I could just do uh, secure facilities. There we go. That'll get me some sentinels. But I don't mind starting out just exploring for a little bit. Look at that view, would you? Look at that. Let's land on the mountain. Let's 
This one looks good. Slow down. Land. Land. How about now? Slower. Land. Bull. Well, there's that. I want to land here, though. All right, we'll land on the edge of the mountain. That's fine. Yeah, look at that. All right, Sentinels, minimal. Hmm. 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 Anything good down here? Yep. Flora typical resources low. There's that. Oh, so how's the video, by the way? I was having the stuttering yesterday. Is is my flying like up this hill nice and smooth now? It should be perfectly smooth. If it's hitching or jumping around or just hard to look at, then something's wrong again. And I need to deal with it. Whee! Smooth, cool. So whatever I did fix, fixed it. Recharge. Right. Is this the one I... No, that's the Baron. Right. That's Hacky Gamma. That's this. The other one could be hiding behind this. That's where I need to go. This could be the last one. Aha! What are you? Unknown. Aggressive Sentinels. Finally. So what do I got in the old exosuit? Uh, I got a, I got two illegal defense system upgrades. There's one with shield strength, and then I got a couple of core health. I think I have a core health over here too. Yeah, core health 33%. And um, what kind of planet was this? It's barren. That doesn't mean it's hot though. So that's okay. So we'll just fight some sentinels. Yellow sky, green water. Could be. Ooh, mountainous, you think? Looks like mountains on the left and a bunch of water on the right. I don't know. Yeah, look at this. Aggressive sentinels and mountainous. And there's a fog. There's definitely a fog. This could be interesting, to say the least. It's Sigadress Sigma. Start off in the valley. It's way, way, way down here. The thing is, there was water. There was a lot of water over here, right? So maybe the mountains won't be as steep over here? Yeah. Maybe. That's pretty cool though. Varying levels of mountains. We're gonna we're gonna park it right in here so right about here. We're fine. Everything's fine. There we go. Oh, I need to name this ship, too. Coop? Where's Watts Coop? Uh... We can just call it Coop. Because I'm... A Coop? I don't know. We'll just call it Coop for now. The Coop. Uh, let's see here. Sentinels are malicious. I'm scared. Alright, let's grab some navigation data. Thank you. Let's 
grab a little extra oxygen. The coop with an E. That's a good idea. Where, if I can find it. Oh yeah, gravitino balls. Right, I could steal those too. <laughs> the coop. C O U. Yeah, sure. This guy's got some good content. I like my normal series. A normal series is a lot of fun. I think, thank you though, I appreciate that. Uh, Alright, so we steal these. I can't because the wings annoy. We steal these, the sentinels come. They're worthless. They really are worthless. And you can't store a lot of them. I'd put them in, I'd put them in the backpack. I mean, let's just do it. Oh man. Don't interrupt me until I'm done. Yep. Oh, we oxygen? I'll get them in a minute. Where's some more uh Where's some more Gravitino balls? I guess not. Uh bulb caster, reload, where'd they go? Guys. Oh look the dog. Okay, they're gonna go over and heal it. And then it's gonna be very hard to shoot them from here. I lied. You're down. So it looks like they're uh, they're having a little problem with the uh, with the terrain. Doesn't bother me a bit. You can't be searching. I'm right here. You're getting there. Close up. Stop hiding in the plants. Ow. My head exploded. Alright. Let's deal with inventory a minute. These need to go to the high capacity. I don't know how many I can store. Oh, a walker. I should run. Should probably run back to the ship at this point. They're searching. Now, I think I can stop the walker from spawning by running away really quick. Yeah. And uh, we'll, we'll just get these. Wrong button. Oh, there's the walker. Alright, I need to get you with the ship. Busy. Alright, we're going in. I don't have my favorite gun, so I really hate shooting walkers without my favorite gun. Where are you? Well, I lost him. And he lost me, so we'll just coast for a while. I do. I need the walker brain to make the combat scanner, but the combat scanner is not really that valuable. I'm not really looking for a low combat system at the moment. So we'll just wait. Actually, you know what's fun? Since they're still searching, let's go to let's go to space while they're still searching. There we go. Four. Come on. You're still searching. Come on. Excellent. Let's see how good I am at shooting these things. So these are the sentinel ships. Yeah, 
that's not too shabby. Give me this. Give me whatever it is you had. Explosive drones. What are these? Frigate upgrades. Ooh. Well, we'll just hang out and shoot the shoot the Sentinel ships for a while. There we go. And they'll never stop, which is a little cheaty. There's two of them now. Get this guy first. Where are you? Yep. Up, 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 up. Get up, up, up. I don't have any extra shields on this ship. I need to remember that. You're gone. And give me your loot. Give me the stuff. That's the way. Mind control device. These aren't the droids you're looking for. You made a mistake. One. Yeah. Oh, Pugnium. Alright. That's enough time for me to get a drink. Where? Oh, down here. Alright, we got two again. First one's gonna bite the farm real quick. Oh, we got a number of them this time. I gotta watch my shields. I got both of you? How is that even possible? Shinies. I got a mind control device. Where'd the other shiny go? I got explosive drones. What's weird is these are sentinel ships. But you can kind of hear them talking. And I don't know if that's... More explosive drones. <laughs> Alright, how many are we going to have now? And I need upgrades. This is normal mode though, so... It's not like permadeath. You also have a chance to escape via pulse engine between the attacks. Yeah, I got. Hear that weird voice? Whoa, look at all of them. Alright, that's bad. That's bad. Uh, let's see, how much sodium do I have? Yeah, we're fine. Just remember to recharge. Alright. So we got a group of them. I need to take this one out. Concentrate on this one. This is like the healer. Get the healer first. Uh, that, oh, they sound like the Cylons, right? From, uh... Oh, shoot. Battlestar Galactica? Give me the stuff. Uh, I'm only after the loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. There we go. More Pugnium. This is good. You know, if, if my ship had more maneuverability, this would be awesome. Let's redo the shield. There we go. Redo the shield again. Thank you. Give me this. Got it. Oh, there's one more. Can't aim. Can't. Aim. Having trouble aiming. Where did he go? I'm backing up as I'm doing this. The old back up, back up and fight technique. Apparently, I got a gold nugget somewhere. Where's your stuff? Where's the stuff? Where'd it go? All right, let's get back to the planet, wherever that is. Don't hit him out. Do you see anything? Is it storming? Let's get outside. I can't really see anything. Ooh. 
We could be spinning out of control. There we go. I was in a cloud. That was cool. Alright, they're still really mad at me. How much Pugnium did I collect? 135. That's not a lot. But I got four of these and four of these, and I should watch where I'm going. Alright, so let's see. We've got we've got five star sentinel alert. If I land and get out. Here they come. Just two of you? No, there's the walker again. Okay, so we just restarted this. So now we'll just scoot along the planet for a while. And they'll start searching, and then we'll end it. Maybe, or maybe I've really pissed them off, and I need to get out of the, get out of the system. I could have really taken them over. Now oh, there they go. Fifty-eight seconds. Good grief. Silence. Yeah. All right, well, it looks like buying Pugnium is going to be better than shooting Sentinels, although I had a lot of fun there. Thirty-eight seconds. All right, so you can see it's down to two. It'll get down to one, and then I think I'm going to test going up, shooting... A All done. Never mind. So what is this an operation center? Ouch. Got it. If I could just find the entrance, that would be great. I'm a novice. I destroyed more than five. I need another uh Okay, so the entrance was apparently I passed it. Or I'm an idiot. I could be an idiot. Here it is, right here. Yeah. I'm a nuisance. I'm all kind of things. Uh, there's a dude here. Oh, is this, this isn't an observatory, is it? Uh, there's the antenna. It's an observatory. All right. Let's just talk to Mr. Holding the Door Open here. They are unused to visitors wandering in from the desert, and they have clearly never seen anything quite like me before. Friend! Gek Trader! Gek Trader! Friend! I mind that I cannot speak their language and increasingly reassured, the Beak Trader indicates they are willing to help in exchange for particular elements. What's the... Carbon. Grateful trader clicks their beak with delight. My offering is clearly what they most desired. They teach me much of the dialect of their people. Much. Two words. And. Do. Two words. Well. That's quite, that's quite something. Yeah, so this, this is the observatory. It finds things off planet. Or, uh, ancient ruins. I'm a colleague. And... Yeah, my ship's over there. So I just missed the door. I just passed the door first time around. Uh, let's get this. Do I see a really big dinosaur over there? I do. It's kind of a walker kind of thing. See what I mean? 
Plus there's there's this. And then there's this big guy. Alrighty then. And I think that thing down there might be... Yeah, that's another... a different one. Don't stop! There we go. Rotting fruit. All right. Anything interesting around here? I can actually, I'm, I'm checking for smoothness again. I'm paranoid. Looks like I'm about five seconds behind too, but it looks really smooth. All right, good. Let's, uh, let's see here. Um, anything close. Subterranean relics, buried cache. Did you hear something? Did you hear something like a ship flying over or something? Ah, look, 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 look. Hold up there, dude. Friend, you, I, them, uh, offer to trade. 1,869 nanites, yeah. So let's see, what do we want? Suspicious mining beam, suspicious scanner, suspicious life support, suspicious hazard protection, suspicious movement, suspicious shield, suspicious hyperdrive, suspicious pulse engine, and starship shield. I want this, I want this, I want this. I'll be back. Um, yeah, transfer to the uh, starship. Uh, transfer to the starship. Um, yeah, don't go anywhere. And where was I? This one? Starship shield, I think. Now here's the thing. This is gambling. This is personal shield. I was okay with the shields I have. Hazard protection is just going to be a percentage. Life support, we don't know. Scanner and mining beam, I don't really need those right now. I could take a second hyperdrive. I could take a second pulse engine if I had the inventory space. It's okay. Uh, transfer to the starship. This is so lame. One more pulse engine. Beautiful. I used up all my nanites. I wasted. You could you could say I wasted. That's a cute little square ship. You could say I wasted. There it goes again. All my nanites. And now I'm punching. Punching with both hands. I thought I was. Alright, here we go. Um, let's transfer the Pugnium to the Starship as well. And uh, anything else? What do we got in cargo? These quad servos can go to the Starship. And Gravitino balls can go to the Starship. Alright. Uh, suspicious Starship Shield Module. Shield strength plus 20%. That's really good. That's really, really good. You go here. You go here. You go here. I'm so excited. Um, yeah, you, you give me some extra gold. Where did that gold go? Back to the exosuit? Yeah. Well, no, you can stay there for now. Okay, what's this? Suspicious pulse engine module? Yep. What do we got? Fuel efficiency six, boost five percent. All right, that's that's a little bit. That's not that's not much, but it's a little bit. We'll put it right next to this, and then I got another pulse, right? Yeah, this one. All 
Maneuverability plus 14%, boost plus 8. All right. Good. I like that. And uh, what else did I get? I got a suspicious hyperdrive module. Why don't we clear out space around the hyperdrive? The Gravitino Balls only stacked to five here? All right, high capacity, high capacity, high capacity. What does that look like then, high capacity? They only stack to 10 in here. These things are worth, look at that, 124,000 units for 10 of them. Now, true, I could collect a lot of them and then sell them. They're 12,000 a piece. I don't think you can refine them down, can you? No. Mm -mm. No. All right. Um, let's get... Here's the hyperdrive right here. We cleared that out. Let's scoot this stuff down here. How much are these things worth? $300,000. 75000 each. Temporary frigate upgrade. One expedition. Mind control device. This helps for trade, right? And in negotiation. Yeah, trade. And what's this one help with? Explosive drones. This helps combat. Yeah, I don't know. I'll probably sell these. Um, I hear a sentinel. You're still here. I'm going to duck inside. I don't have the pugnum or the nanites anyway. I'm going to head inside if I can aim. Uh, what else was I doing? Uh, suspicious hyperdrive module. Mm. What do we got? Warp cell, 100%. Hyperdrive range, plus 109. Okay, that's fairly good. And the other hyperdrive module? Warp cell efficiency, plus 100%. Okay, less fuel, but not any better range. So now our hyperdrive range is 215. If only I had more nanites, but that's the way it goes. All right. So we got more contraband. Hey. Hey. I forget, how much pug name did I get for that? Sixteen, hardly worth it. Three. Should have reloaded first. Reload. I didn't hit you, did I? To just two to the bullcaster. Now we get the dog, I think. I want to get a little closer to the ship. There we go. We'll get you guys after we reload. The name of that little ball on the bottom. Where'd the other dude go? Ah, sorry. The dog's getting me. Just need to get this guy. Reload. Ah. Oh. No, you don't. Why aren't you shooting? The gun locked out. Weird. Reload. Damn, Sam. Punk. Almost got him. Alright, got another one of these. That was horrible. That's that's exactly how you don't fight. And there should be another one around here somewhere. Did I not get it? Did it roll away? Is it over here? 
Oh, here comes the walker, so now I gotta get out of here. What's over here? Yeah. Hold still. Where's my ship? Alright. So how much Pugnam did I get total? 168. Another quad servo goes to the starship. Another Pugnam goes to the starship. Reganation, thanks for the file, I appreciate it. We'll just let them continue searching for a bit. Now look, over here, the mountains aren't nearly as steep. Which I think is pretty darn cool. So you definitely have areas of really tall, steep mountains versus, let's call them foothills. Thanks, man. I picked it up at the, la at the my starter system just because I was desperate for more inventory. It's only a B class and uh, pretty bad inventory, but it's a living. All right. Um, we'll just land here. They're, they're, they're done searching. We'll land here. We'll, we'll take out the machinery, the damaged machinery. Get the thing. The thing. Where's the thing? Oh, that's right. They're aggressive here. Nuisance. Thank you. What do you got? Just nanites. There's what I was looking for. More nanites. That was the Gex standing. There's the nanites. Let's catch this. Hey, Seti Hattie, how's it going? What do we have? I need to sell some of this junk, and I guess I'm gonna need to scrap ships to buy upgrades, which is a bit dull. See, I'm falling into the same old, same old, same old again. You know what? It's time to warp. We can get in a freighter battle. This ship has done fine. This ship has done fine uh, fighting. And I have the economy scanner now, and only 200 light years warp range, but give me a tier 3. Give me a tier 3 anything. Oh, there it was. Two planets? Alright, whatever. go. It's a big butt freighter. <laughs> I don't want to really fight close to him. There's five ships remaining. And they're over here. Here they come. Slow it down. Getting a lock on. Did I kill good? Did I hit good guys? I might have hitting good guys. Hitting, hitting. There's a new word for you. Hitting. I done hitting them. There's one. Holy cow! They're moving slow. Magnetize ferrite. Thank you. All right, I have I have a new appreciation for permadeath mode because they move a heck of a lot faster, 
in uh, survival and primitive. Thank you. Oh, give me these. Give me these. All right, mind control device, magnetized ferry. Hey man, yep, Fitzwar, Muzi, something. Let's uh, check out your freighter. Where? Up here somewhere, over here somewhere. Where's the freighter? Trailblazer. All right, do you see the symbol? I'm getting all kind of messages. I've had it. All right, freighter's over here somewhere. Oh, it's right. It's this one. Near the side. Slow down. This is an interesting-looking freighter, admittedly. It's got the little circular front. And, uh, wow. This is going to be a C-Class. Why get my hopes up? Why even get my hopes up? Hopes up. Sounds like a nightmare, said you, Hattie. Sounds like a nightmare. <laughs> if you woke up with me talking to you, that definitely sounds like a nightmare. It is a C-15-3. Alright, I'll, I'll only talk to him because he'll give me um, chromatic metal. Usually. I got... Wow, that was weird. I got... Yeah, I got free inventory. Barely. It's unfortunate. But typical for your first freighter battle. Yeah, no, uh, request payment instead, please. Uh, chromatic metal, 197 of it. Where did it go? Looks like it actually went in the right spot. Okay. You know, even though it's... Even if you don't own the freighter, you can still use the freighter like a space station if you want. Other ships will land and you can talk to their pilots. Oh, here's another one of these ships. That's mine. I was going to say, there's another one of these ships in green, but it's gone. The coop. Catch a save. Let's hit up the space station. Yeah, it's too bad. It's, uh, it's... It's not an ugly freighter. There, that's that's how far I'll be. Long runway. I forgot to check the uh, combat in the system. Uh, conflict level is medium, but it's a rich system. Let's get the suit slot. I lagged. Okay, this experimental version it might not be the best idea ever. Because I do keep lagging. I don't get any errors, but I'm lagging a little bit. Uh, we don't want to do cargo. Because it's 250,000. Might want to do technology for how much? 60? Main suit's 10,000. Main suit. Alright. And I can't buy anything from these guys. I can look at the gun. It's a B gun. Mm. Already upgraded mine. Hey, how's it going? Uh, if I could guess what this guy needs, he might do something. The electronic lights warms bright green. S greeting suddenly slows. They tap into their personal data while their facial lights dilate and internal systems crash. Columns of streaming data show their power levels spiraling downward. Corvax, Entity. Mm, 
Life form looks to me for help, and then they point to my gathered resources with a single slow, desperate movement. I think they need carbon. I might have this wrong. Ferrite dust doesn't charge anything, but carbon does. Slowly, painfully, the entity inserts the element into the slot in their hip. Gradually, power returns to their shell. Corvex nods politely, that they seem a little embarrassed to have made the request. They give a gift of their own and thanks. Nanites. 110. That ain't, that ain't too shabby. You wouldn't happen to have any pugnium for sale, would you? No, I didn't think so. What do you got? Star Trek freighter, yeah. Um, ask what they are selling. Purchase old scrap. All right, I don't know how much pugnium I have. I don't have enough to do this. Disco, disco, disco. Yeah, I could buy some more. Let me find some more before I do that. I'd like to have just a little bit more for the contraband. Also, since I'm here, right, I'll talk to this guy because he just arrived. Oh, thank you. Uh, giddy bum bum traveler. Uh, buy items. You got any pugnium? You do. How much? A lot. I'll take it. Okay, now before I get too crazy, before I get too crazy, um, if I wanted to build a better gun, I never bought the gun. How about that? I was just going to up. That's right. I said I was. I was said I was just going to upgrade the photon cannon. I've been doing pretty well with it. This I got from Polo. Right. And then the rocket launchers I'm not using. All right. So he had pugnium. That's good. Do 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 do. I can get missions. Uh, scan five minerals? Absolutely. Kill 13 creatures? Sure. Mm, kill 11 creatures? Sure. Although I haven't, I've been having trouble finding aggressives. I find it funny that I loved normal mode when I first started, but now normal mode's really frustrating. Because you've got to really, it's, it's, of course, it's, it's all about chill exploration. That's how they advertise, oh, I forgot to visit the thing. That's how they advertise normal mode. But, I need more aggressive creatures. Uh, you got any pugnium here? Nope. You have paraffinium, which I could mine. But if I buy it, I could build stuff. Uh, I forget how much I need to build stuff with. But... Let's buy, let's buy a thousand of it, if I can, can you go? No, you're not going to go anymore. Okay, I'll use the keyboard. And that's enough right there. There, and then let's sell some stuff. Um, I'm going to sell the gold. I'll sell the Gravitino Balls for 162. And there's the paraffinium I just bought. 578 ferrite dust. Oxygen, sodium, condensed carbon, dihydrogen, tritium, navigation data. I need all that. Let's switch to the starship. Uh, magnetized ferrite, uranium salvage data. This is what I was going to sell for cash if I needed it. Uh, deuterium. Yeah, I don't need this right now. And silver... I don't need at the moment. These quad servers, servos, I need for something. I need quad servos for an upgrade, but they're easy to get, so I'll sell them. Explosive drone, again, I don't need these until I have frigates, which will be a while, so I'll gladly take 353,000. And uh, I have more pugnium in the starship. Mind control device, I think I should sell it. 
All right, let's buy some contraband. Uh, purchase old scrap. All right, let's see. Quantum computer, hydraulic wiring, suspicious packet weaponry. I want two of these. I want both of these. And we'll see what we have here. I need I need starship weapon upgrades. There we go. What the heck is this? What the heck is this? All right, it's screwed up. I it said suspicious packet weaponry, and I get chipped cooking supplies for four hundred eighty-eight thousand. Uh, black market modification for the blaze javelin. Nope. I don't even know. I don't even know. But um, I can sell things to you. So let's sell. We will sell the suspicious blaze javelin module for 313 nanites. And I can actually sell the rare item to you. And this space station is making that strange rumbling noise. Like it's falling apart. Yeah. Sell. Uh, where is that rare item? Right here. Chipped cooking supplies. I have 2,900 pugnium left. Alright. Bye. See, that, that should have been up in goods. Not in weaponry. All right, we'll do technology, and that's all you have. Pulse engine module. Okay. What does this give me? Maneuverability 12, boost 6, fuel efficiency plus 6. I'll take it. There's my upgrade so far. Mm. Now, wait a minute. I bought the cadmium upgrade, upgrade to the hyperdrive. Yep, we can visit Red Star Systems now. Okay, I forgot about that. Here we go. And... You don't have anything left. We did the freighter battle. Let's hop over here. Oh, there you are. Uneven. Unsymmetrical. Horrible. All right, let's do... Just for a second, there was nobody here. Uh, no, I don't want to talk to the Gek. I want to talk to the Corvax. Here you are. Uh -huh. Request dialect help. Technology. Research. And then let's practice the language. Let's see if I can get any free stuff. It's only the Corvax. I don't care if I get it wrong. Research. Taking this word to demonstrate an interest in technology and the in Berguda proudly shows me an advanced feature of their carapace. I don't want to know what I just saw. Alright. How about you? <laughs> Request dialect help. Life forms visor warps and flickers. Some inter intercorvex consultation taking place. A moment later, geologist entity Devo. Are we not men? We are Devo. Is restored. They present a list of language symbols. Technology. Technology. Appropriate. Practice. Researcher. Geologist is very pleased by this word. Apparently assuming I am fluent in Corvax, they begin to chatter at great length, gesturing towards my suit and multi-tool. Okay, standing increased. But I'm not getting any free stuff, and let's face it, all I want is free stuff. Entity Spo. We'll just call him Spoo. 
Um, Corvex is pretty busy. Request dialect help. What do you think? How about a Corvex symbol? Convergence. Alright. Let's practice the language. Ooh. Entities. Entity, anal analyst entity Spoo reacts powerfully to this word. Gripping my hand tightly, I feel a spark of energy pass between us. Just Corvax standing. Alright. That's fine. Playing hard to get, I think. Uh, oops. Interpreter. Have I visited you? Yes. Have I visited you? There's three of you here. One of them I haven't visited. Looks like you. Not a word. <clears throat> Request dialect help. Anyone know where on the salvage data treat to unlock the barrel fabricator? Hey, falling down. How's it going? Barrel fabricator. Barrel fabricator. So that, make, that doesn't make any sense to me. How about trade? Any word for trade? That's fine. Um, practice. Tech. Corvax sings a delighted song. This word obviously touches upon a subject they favor. They offer me a module of what appears to be homemade technology. Ah, geology cannon. Hey man, I learned something. Dolby the Nordic, thanks for the follow, appreciate it. Um, right, I wanted to go here because it probably pinned it. Yes, let's unpin it. I appreciate the suggestion. You don't mind if I stand on a table or a chair, do you? Because there's this middle entity that's standing. You guys are standing really close. Uh, request dialect help. Another Corvax symbol. Echoes. What a strange and interesting word. Practice. Research. Uh, Anosti is very pleased by this word. Apparently, assuming I'm fluent in Corvax, I begin to chatter at a great length, gesturing towards my suit and multitude. Okay, I'll get, I'll get a standing increase, which is not really what I'm after. I'm after fat loot. But, uh, what about you? Quest dialect help. I need more words. Let's do a travel symbol. Unknown. Mm-hmm. Practice. I have never practiced language skills until I saw Resorty do it. Never. Not even once. Uh, unknown is what the word I just learned. Echoes. Tech trade. Echoes. Uh, advisor brightens. I suddenly seem much more engaged in this conversation. Their estimation of me improved. All right, standing. That's it. Blueprint Analyzer. Apparently you can build the barrels that you need. The Atlas Pass version 1 to loot. The Barrel Fabricator. The Blueprint can be acquired from the Blueprint Analyzer. What Blueprint Analyzer? What, what Blueprint Analyzer? I, I feel like I'm hearing about a whole part of the game I haven't played yet. Look at this little dude. I like this. This is like a stub from my save with uh, with little square engines from my other normal save. V25. Apostle of the Gusuki. 5.8 million units. I don't have it. And I don't want to duplicate my other ship. But uh, I like the square engines. And this beast, C40. Gaharan of Freedom. And uh, here's the screen ship again. The TIE Fighter deal. 
A18, 2 million. I could break it down. I could break it down. You're gonna have to do this at some point. Do I have any inventory though? I don't have enough inventory because it's just a disaster. That's why. It's just an absolute disaster. I'll talk to you anyway. I can put some on my starship. don't remember if I have enough inventory or units or not. I have four million, you want two million for this ship. I'll buy it. I got it. Okay. Let's go back to mine. Shuttle. Um, let's swap some stuff to the starship. High capacity. And Pugnium will keep on the starship. Tritium should be on the starship for sure. This should be down here. This thermal protection module. Um, did I buy a technology slot? I didn't. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven might be enough. Um, so let's get in this again. Hop back out. Alright. Baroness! Thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. And let's go into Starship Outfitting. And I want to melt it. 1.4 million. Inventory full, I feel like, is what the suit lady is going to say. Told you. So I'm going to get uh, 1, 2, Two, three upgrade modules. Alright. We got more storage in the starship. Just need to reactivate it again. Yeah, let's put this that I'm carrying around uh, oops, into the starship. And what do I got in cargo? Let's put this into the starship. Uh, the wiring looms can stay back here. The carbon can go here. Oxygen I'm carrying a lot around, so let's go to Exosuit High Capacity. Again, I'm playing this like it's permadeath and it's not. The cargo is good for this stuff with limited stacking. So if you like have a limit of 10, the cargo will allow you to do 20. That's what the cargo is good for, for this, this kind of stuff. Not this, because this is all 9999 regardless, as far as I know. Alright, let's see if we just needed the one more slot. And then be careful. Let's make you active again, because you're the one I'm going to scrap. It's a pretty ship, though, if you like green. You're a C-15. You're an A-28. Nope. How about now? Please? Yay. Alright. Any storage augmentation? Hey, we got one storage augmentation. Totally gonna use it. Alright, what do we get? Phase beam module, infra knife module, starship shield module. I'm not gonna use any, I'm just gonna sell them. I said in my custom rules that if I scrapped a ship, that's how I could use these. I don't know, I have this, this, this stupid idea that for some reason I can't buy technology off these guys but I can sell it to them it's not, it's not a perfect rule uh, sell 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 gotta use the contraband man the illegal stuff alright uh, the radiant pillar is here but I want to make this ship active you hear the rumble in the space station I was hoping they'd fix that in the experimental build but they haven't yet it's still rumbling. Alright, let's apply some storage augment- the one storage augmentation we have. Uh, this one I think. Uh, purchase would be 11 million. Apply augmentation. We have no choice, it'll go there, apply it. There we go. Yay. One extra storage spot. Okay. 
Look at that thing. That looks like a toy. No other... That's a hauler. A48-8, 112 million. <laughs> and you're a B27. We'll give it a few. It's in the blue pen analyzer, not on the anomaly. Hey, Joshy, how's it going? It's in the blueprint analyzer, not on the anomaly. I still don't know this blueprint analyzer. You mean the little square thing? The little... The little, uh... The one you have to build the construction? Not the construction station. I know, but I'd like to know what the heck it is. Oh well. B18. Um, I scanned you, right? Yeah, B18. And I'm not doing anything with these big haulers. How much money do I have left? Uh, why don't we sell some stuff? I got a bunch of uh, crap in my inventory now, and I'm not going to be doing anything unless I sell this stuff first. Right. Uh, tank of coolant, once useful springs, and subatomic regulators, thermal panels, handful of cogs. Is that it? That looks to be it. We could start doing the suit slots with the car. Um, I might have bought the motorcycle as well. I might have. Yeah, that sounds like more fun. Maybe. Let's, uh, let's fly around. Let's check out the planets in this system. I haven't done that yet. Catch a save. We got I got a lot of free inventory, right? I wouldn't go with a lot, but I have some. What do we got here? It's a bleak planet. All right, and uh, and there's a second planet in this system right here. Scorched, high sentinel activity. But no buried bones or anything like that. And there's only two, correct? There's only two. I'll land on one of them, just to say I did. Alright, I got you. That's a construction terminal, though, right? We'll land next to this knowledge stone. Might as well have something to do. We're here. What was the name of this planet? What was the name? Sit Katrinicus Katrinus uh 10, 15, 16, 17. Hmm. That's great. Let's get out of here. Alright, let's warp to another system. Easy now. Galaxy map. We're in Skugga. <laughs> I did, didn't notice that. I do have the cadmium drive, right? You? I do. There's a lot of planets here and no space station. This could be interesting. Let's go here.
right. Uh, they need to make these names easier for me to pronounce. It's a finned planet. Meh. Meh. There's another planet on the other side. Um, we might get... We got two planets here. Looks like I can get this one. What do you got? Oh, I missed it. Wait for the scanner to recharge. As we sit idly in space. And it's a metallurgic planet. That's the second oddball planet. And this is... A wine dark planet. Well, this is a heck of a system. Here's another planet popping up. What are you? A spined planet. Good grief. What are you? A fractured planet. Alright. And there's only one planet I can't scan which appears to be right behind this planet. So we'll just, easy, we'll just go out this way a little bit. Shouldn't have to go too far. Can you see it? No. Yeah, there it is right there. No. It was down here, this guy. Yes. A barren planet. Salvageable scrapped. Activated cadmium. Well, that's unfortunate. However, as long as it's not too loud, it looks like it's going to have storms. But I'd like to do the salvageable scrap. The storms are so darn loud right now. It's basically they... they you get the wind sound, but it's completely clipped at maximum. So it just... the needle just goes all the way up to 11. And that's all you hear. A fin planet? It's got these weird long fin things. It's it's one of those exotic planets. They're they're like little spikes with lights on them. You, if you've watched any No Man's Sky, you've probably seen them before. You just don't know what it's called. You're goofy. The planet has fins. And hi, filthy, by the way. very red. The barren planet is very red. What do we got? Interesting. This is rather cool looking. I believe this is a... I hope it's not an extreme hazard planet. It could be. This name. Combustible dust. Those rocks are off the ground. Yeah, this is an extreme hazard planet. I don't really have a heat shield. Well, that'll make this challenging, won't it? Um, I don't want the organic rock, I want the salvage container. It's 635. Alright, let's hop in here. Scoot over towards it. Select the train manipulator, please. I had it. Wall of flame detected. This can't be good. All right, let's actually go up. All right, there we go. Let's clear this whole thing out. Let's 
try to get this before the wall of flame gets here. Mining beam. Come on. You keep stopping. Why does it keep... Why do you keep stopping? Uh, yeah, this wall of flame is pretty hot. Mining beam? How can I get to the protective coating? Is that it? Yeah, I think that was it. And there we go. Come on. Come on. I got fuse plating. Can't scare me. Look at the flames. Yeah, it's hot. Alright, what do we get? Um, fuse plating. 261,000. All right. We got any more? Uh, I got 46 seconds to find another one. Yes. 840. There's another container. Let's go. Let's get into the goof. Beautiful day. Uh, you're gonna be right there. All right. Oh, you're sticking out of the ground, kind of cool. All right. There it is. And uh, let's see if I got the train manipulator. Let's go bigger. That's that's big. All right. Maybe too big. Yeah, rare item. Yeah, extreme heat damage is bad, isn't it? Where are these guys? Reload. They seem very upset with me. Oh, here they are. Well, this is fun. Where'd the other one go? Right here. Reload, 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 reload. Right, there's only two of them? Mining beam. No, mining beam. Mining beam. Uh, and we still have enough time to get back into the ship. Alright, what did we get? We got something. Oh, it's so quiet. We got an experimental gyroscope worth two million bucks. <laughs> Pro skills. <laughs> beautiful day for your for a neighbor if your neighbor's Satan. Yeah, it's a beautiful firestorm out. All right, you know the storm could end at any time. It would be nice with me. Nice by me. Nice. There's ways to calm the noise. Do we see any more salvage data in? Yes. Uh, 341 is the closest. So let's get back in. How are the old launch thrusters doing? Not too shabby. Oh, this is really close. How come I couldn't see this before? Park too close. Hey, Katsina. Yeah. A little uh, Johnny Cash. Yeah, I might be able to trade it up at a uh, archive terminal, but then again, it might screw me over. There's multiple archive terminals. Though. 
This storm's this storm's nothing. Alright. Let's hope for rare two to the mining beam. I don't think so. There, keep stopping. Oh, is it because the storm's interfering with it? Rare item found. 500,000. Alright. How many seconds I got? I got 25 seconds. Alright, there was another one around here somewhere, I swear it. Do we see it? Anywhere? I swear there was another one. Yeah, there's one over here. Yeah, that's not too far away. Okay. In before we, we take damage, straight ahead. Next to that giant bouncy. Let's don't hurt the bouncy. Right, let's park here on top of this rock. Or in the rock. Ooh, cool. These things. Uh, destination reached. Alright. Uh, mining beam, please. Where's this bad guy? Right there. Yeah, don't bother me. Alright, where's this? Here? I might be in... Nope, we're good. I was going to say, I might be too close to the ship. I think we're okay. Two to the mining beam. Uh-oh. What's going on? Is there another one over here? There's a lot of them. Rare item, yellow. Wow. Uh, I'm getting pretty lucky. Let's see what we got. This is an extraordinary processor for 2.7 million. Did something just fly right over the... Did you see that? Did you see that thing fly? Did you see that? I think it's just these, uh, these mobs. Or a fire. Uh, I could use some full pure ferrite. Or pure parite. Yeah, I think it's those mobs. Let's get this rock out of the way. Give me some visibility. And we'll try to get one of those bouncy mobs. So on my home planet, I have one of those uh, archives, a save beacon by one, so I can try to trade out one of these. But I don't know if you can trade up all of them. I'll take the geode. Thank you. See if I can catch one of these things flying around. Um, just have to get them in the air. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Got it. Cool. Worth 111 grand, which with hardly any scanner upgrades. That's good. I got 1 minute 46 seconds left. Any other mobs that I don't know about? Oh, you're different. Wherever you went, you're gone. Oh, I had them. They're bigger. The, the second one is bigger. See, these are just little spirally things, but that second one is is pretty pretty big. I'm never gonna be able to get them. Yep, I got you guys. Okay, 
So there's one other one. Good grief. Pretty cool though. Alright, I'm wasting uh, good weather. Any more salvage containers nearby? I don't see any. Why don't we go to the bright side of the planet? De Ver. What does that mean? Yeah, here's a bright side. Uh, we'll go right down in the middle. Chateau of the Worms. So. I don't think this planet has water on it. It just has these weird valleys. And, uh, it has activated cadmium. I need just regular cadmium, honestly. Not activated. But, now that we're on the beautiful bright side of the planet, yeah, these big uh, grand canyons, so to speak. Alright. Catnips, thanks thanks for the follow, appreciate it. Come on, salvage data, come on. Not salvage data, salvage containers. There we go. Seven seventeen. Any other ones? Not that I can see with a quick glance. Brakes. They're kind of sticking out of the ground. This is good. We're land right over here. Um, I thought I saw you sticking out of the ground, but I don't think it is. Let's active the mining beam. Uh, let's actually recharge this. And let's switch to train manipulator. We should recharge this with silicon powder. Let's clear the way here. I get to the whole thing. Get rid of this hill. All gone. Off you go. Alright, mining beam. Yeah, there was only two. This is gonna be a loser. Crusty belting. Total loser. Alright, how much inventory do I have left? A couple spots. One spot. What was this? 132,000. I should delete it out of protest. Pyrite? Let's go to the starship. Uh, oh, right. Scan. Uh, there's another one. 201. Now that it's day, the launch thrusters should be charging, but never mind. We have your mind. Uh, oh. Right over here. We'll do one more. Train manipulator. Pull this out. Yeah, it's gonna be a little stormy. A little stormy. This one looks good. Sorry, mining me. One. Excellent. Two. Three. Excellent. Four. Give me the goods. 
Give me the goods. Got it. Thanks for thanks for letting me know. Uh, can I fight these guys? Sure. Bullcaster. We got half a shield left. Thank you. I'm a little busy right now for that. Just two of them? I swear there was more. Mining beam. Come back here, come back. Mining beam. Where'd the other one go? There it is. Goodness. Uh, so what do we get? Another one of these. 2.1 million. 2, 4, 6 million. Plus 500,000. Plus a couple of losers. Uh, that's 260. This is 130. I don't know. What did we get? 2. That's almost 3. 4, 5, 6, 7. Maybe almost 8 million. That's not too bad. Catnip. According to Google Translate. I got you. Sorry I wasn't paying attention. All right. Well, why don't we... Um, you know what I should do? In the storm, you see. Beautiful vista here. Now, I don't have very much. I don't have very much. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It's the LeBron colony. Claim it. I don't have very many good base parts at the moment, but there's no space station in this system that I know of. Uh, I think I can I can verify that, right? Yeah, XXX. So we'll put we'll put a base down. Uh, where's the edge? I was right near the edge, right? Looked a lot closer when it flew up in the air. Huh. Right here's fine, I guess. Oops. Wooden. This is all I got is wooden. That's horrible. Oh well. It'll have to do. How many of these can I build? 22? That's fine. Invalid position? Don't give me that. What do you mean, invalid position? What are you talking about? Uh, what do I need to get rid of? I need to get rid of this thing? I'm not even going to identify it. Otherwise, I'm not quite sure what you're telling me, unless I need to put a floor down to change the terrain. Oh! Blue thing in the way. Right. Hitbox of the, the hydrogen in the way. Yeah, let's clear these things out, and that should solve that little problem. There we go. And uh, let's put a floor in to get rid of that. I don't know where that went. Uh, it went over here. Beautiful. Now let's go to this side. What do you say? Perfect. That's what happens when you try to build too quick. 
I think if I was in the camera, I'd be protected. I'm not sure about that. Let's give it a let's give it a try. Uh, let's do that and then hit C. There we go. Yeah, it stopped falling. Look at that. Perfect. Base build in the safety of. Let's do this. Let's do one of these. And then let's put here and here and here. And let's put a roof on. How many of these can I build? 26, no problem. And here, 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 here. There we go. Uh, you know what? Let's take that out. Because I'm probably going to want to build a storage container here. All right, let's get that. Ah. Uh, um, now I want to build a teleporter. General teleporter. I need four metal plating and two carbon nanotubes. Look at this inventory. What a disaster. Um, let's transfer this to the starship. And this to the starship. And let's build, what did I say? Two carbon nanotubes and something like four metal plating? Maybe? Yep. And you'll go right over here. And I'm just going to build the uh, crappy little... Crappy little... Not a wire power, not that power. The biofuel reactor. Uh, one more metal plating. This will give us a way out of here. And I don't... Let's see if I can build the storage container. Uh, actually, it's ready to build. Now, can I get it to go uphill? I can't. Alright, that's okay. Stop it. Oh. Now I can change modes. All right. There's a flatten for you. For some reason, I couldn't do that from inside. Now I can. I'm confused. Anyway, let's uh, fit this right in here. Actually, wait a minute. I, re I learned this last time. I can actually do it through a wall. So, never mind. Now, tech. Storage. Maybe I can't hear because it's stuck on the hillside. It doesn't like that at all. Alright, never mind. Now I can do this. Good enough. Alright, and then I can at least transfer stuff to that. Anyway, let's get out of here. Thirteen's fine. Uh, I should name this base. So I wasted some oxygen. So what? Uh, wrong door. That would be bad. Uh, where's the base computer? Way over here. Name it. Uh, what was I doing? Salvage database? Salvage. Salvage. I'll do it. Database. <laughs> And uh, capture a new screenshot. Uh, yeah, it's be it's beautiful, man. Let's get down here. And let's get back here a little bit. And there it is on the hillside, like that going on. Too bad it's not daytime, but I'm not going to wait around. Everything still looks smooth, right? It sure does. How about that? Alright. Now let's recharge this and get out of here. Oxygen C key to cut it in half. Down to 12. Perfect. And let's go to first base, please. Do, 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 do. Wherever it is. Storm. To first base. 
go. Clear out of there. Hot garbage. <laughs> That's a better name. That is a better name. Hot garbage. A much better name. Oh well, I got a techie name. And we're back. Now I didn't put a floor in, that's why it's grassy. Lest you think catch a save. Lest you think the uh, the grass grew up over the over the floor. And the ship again is inside my base, half inside the base. It's unfortunate. Uh, right, I want to go to the save beacon now. It's, let's see, circle, 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 circle. Where is it? It's right here. How far away is it? It doesn't say how far away. I have no idea, so we'll go out and back. I use light blue for archive. I didn't really know what color to use, honestly. It can't be purple. Oh, it should have been brown, right? I think I'll change it to brown. Archive, paper, parchment, brown. You know what I'm talking about. It doesn't make any sense in a space game, but I think brown works for me. Let's get out before a ship lands on us. We'll just ignore it. Ow, let me out! Let me out! I can't see! Oh yeah, manual torch. Hey, there's the machine I want. First things first, though. Yep, that ship landed right on top of us. Uh, let's see, go over to color. And we'll change it to... Is there a brown? Yeah, there's a brown. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's good. I like it. Alright. Uh, let's uh, recharge the... Wow. Let's recharge the life support. Okay, so here's the thing. There's, there's, there's these here. I'm not familiar with this particular... Am I though? Yeah, I am. And there's ones down here, too. Let's do the one down here first. This is advertising uh, Vitex. It's, from, it's similar to Gorlax. Gorlax, or whatever that, that one coat material is. Um, yep. Alright. Do not rip me off. Oh! I can't. So you cannot do salvage. You only you can only do artifacts and bones. How about that? How about that? Well, that's okay because this is similar to a a minor settlement in that um, you can sell without crashing the economy. Okay. Uh, this is a um, a paradise planet. The uh, scanner says it has torrid del deluges, but it doesn't. Um, it's the, the weather is fine. Wish you were here. <laughs> uh, um, purchase components. Sell. What do we got? We got uh, extraordinary processor. Demand is minus seven percent. Why you got to be like that? Why you gotta be like that? Demand is plus three. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about it. Uh, 2.5 million. Uh, 2 million. Minus 10% on the rusty compressor. I might take that. I'm gonna take my business elsewhere. Uh, oh, intact pneumatics. I forgot this one. Uh, 2.1 million, sure. And then if we switch to the starship, we've got fuse plating. Uh, good enough. Who cares? And crusty belting, a whopping plus 5.4 percent. All right, it's all it's all good. And then, so the only one I didn't sell is this somewhat rare rusty compressor, which I'll sell somewhere else.
Uh, hey, Chimera. Um, yeah, it's, it's, I got lucky. It's in my home system, too. And my home system happens to be wealthy. It's one reason I decided to continue this normal series, is just because I got so lucky with the start. Um, let's see here. Uh, yeah, what was I gonna do? I was gonna go up to the space station. I don't have a base here, so I'm gonna have to go back to my base. Where's, where'd I put my ship? Uh, over there. Scoot, 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 scoot. There we go. Let's go up to the space station. Jump out. There you go. Get a save. Jump back in. A hauler landing on top of you. I hope they fix this. They gotta fix that before this version goes live. Space station somewhere out here. There we go. And I got some pugnium, so I'm gonna check this this uh, scrap dealer out. See if I can get any upgrades. I'd like a few upgrades to the, uh, to the ship's gun. And there we go. And there we go. The plus maneuverability really helps, um, fly the ship. Hey man, I think your specialty was what? The mining beam? Purchase old scrap. Suspicious mining beam, yeah. Let's get the suspicious, but you only got one? It's most unfortunate. Alright, what do you got? Uh, where'd it go? Here it is. Uh, it's a band blaze javelin upgrade, so I'll sell it. It's just the way it goes. Nothing doing. A gas bubble that could talk and gave you nanites? Wow. Hey, woo. How's it going? Uh, they're basically just random upgrades. I made this silly rule that I, I cannot buy any of these upgrades. I cannot buy upgrades. I got I got to use contraband, which is what the scrap dealer sells. Um, now I can use the regular upgrades if I get them from scrapping ships, but that's it. And I might change that rule. And just say I flat out cannot use regular upgrades. So that's a different new ship. B25. How much cash do I have now? 10 million! Off that scrap, off the uh, salvage data. That's nice. Alright, so mining beam I don't really care about. Suspicious packet technology. Actually, this... Yeah, no. I'll buy one. And let's buy one goods. The goods can be interesting. And also really a waste of money. So here's the goods. Let's do that first. I got a walker brain. <laughs> well, there you go. Now I don't have to... Uh, now I don't have to hit up uh, kill a walker. Because I got a walker brain. So, any negative any negative thing that I said about uh, the goods, I take back completely. Uh, suspicious package technology. We get uh, suspicious hazard protection. So here's the thing. Because I can't buy, I can't use. No, buy. Because uh, I'm using some of them. These, uh, 
these um, es these radiation protection upgrades, the upgrades you can usually buy on, off them. These are the shields that um, you know you recharge with uranium. The ones you get from here are just resistance drops. Um, this is one from the anomaly, so heat resistance plus 21%. Maybe that's why I could survive on that hot planet. But if you look at this, it's going to be radiation resistance 2, toxic 2, cold resistance 6, heat resistance 2. I mean, I mean, uh, you could stack them and completely take up your inventory with these things, but uh, no thanks. Uh, so I got a wiring loom. We'll put that in high capacity. And I got an ion battery, uh, which I don't really care about, so I'll delete. All right. And I believe the market price is going to be the same here for that uh, for that one rare item. I have to go somewhere else. Yeah, probably. Now here the demand's only minus 1.7 percent, so it's sold. And supposedly that percentage resistance was added this version. Yeah, stats can be randomized. Totally randomized. Totally randomized. So some of them are better than S-Class and some of them aren't. But if you have a lot of Pugnium, you can basically buy them and without even looking at them, just go over and sell them for Nanites. So you can turn Pugnium into Nanites if that's your thing. Um, but there, well, for example, yeah, uh, let's purchase some more scrap. Um, let's do another technology. We'll do two more technologies because it's fun. And we'll do another goods just to see what we come up with. Um, you give me nanites? I get technology, suspicious package technology. So sometimes they're really losers. How many nanites will this give me? 1994, 2062. What a waste. Suspicious pack of goods. I got a repair kit. All right. That ain't bad. Repair kit. That's not bad. Uh, we'll put you in the. Um, we'll put. I'll go back and put you in storage somewhere. And then technology. We get another band pulse engine upgrade. So look at my pulse engine upgrades, right? I'm using all uh, illegal hype, uh, illegal pulse engine upgrades. So this one's plus six, plus five. That's not what a C. This one's 12, six, and six. Maybe a B. And this one's plus 14 maneuverability. The, the, the interesting thing about these is that sometimes one stat can be a lot higher than you'd normally ever get. But the other stat, but you might only get one stat or the other stat could just stink. So it's it's kind of a crapshoot. Um, am I storing any Pugnium in the exosuit? I don't think so. No. I'm not. So I don't have very much Pugnium left anymore. Um, so let's put on this other pulse engine upgrade. And this is going to overload, so let's look at what it does. Boost plus 5%. Uh, boost plus 6%. Boost plus 5%. This is a complete loser upgrade. This is like less than a C. Complete loser upgrade anyway, so it's gone. And I get some cadmium. That's great. And some deuterium. That's great. My inventory is all full up. Alright. Let's... Uh I could attempt to buy some more Pugnium. Do you have any? Not for here, but for another system. You do not. And how about you over here? Don't go. Don't go. Don't go. I'm approaching. There you go. Got any uh, Pugnium available? Nope. Nope. Surely not. You get a new guy? Yeah. Two new guys. Back to you. Nope. Paraffinium, that's that's your special. And what do you got? 
you start to learn that there's like four or five inventories available and they they oops didn't want to do that paraffinium nope no pugnium how about this explorer getting my exercise Do, do, do. Nope, you've got the gold and the quantum computer, but no pug Alright, All right, I've had it. Let's go back and put some of the stuff in storage. Uh, first base. I haven't seen one. The best resistance I've seen is 10% on an X on one of them, which is worse than the anomaly upgrades. But since I can't use the shields, it makes, like, if, if I wanted to do storm crystals, for instance, that makes it kind of interesting. Wow. I've been impaled on the, on the ship's antenna there. And you hear a, there's a lot of background noise going on. Maybe not so much over here. My base is very noisy. Anyway, uh, let's get close so I can say, right, you go into the storage container inventory and pure ferrite. Mm, yeah. Better keep it with me. No, nah, storage container inventory. Uh, cargo. I always like to keep those with me. Let's go to the starship. Uh, where's that walker brain? Storage container inventory. I could go ahead and make that combat scanner. What does it need? Conflict scanner. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Uh, let's transfer it back. Come back here. There you go. And then... Yeah, I'm going to have to put it... Let's put it in the... Uh, let's put it in the bottom corner here. One conflict scanner coming up. Walker brain, use it. Alright. What else do I want to do here? Um, the cadmium is going to be good for the emerald drive. I'll try to remember I put it there. Um, this, this is a cold protection module that is rechargeable. And I, I got it off a of damaged machinery, so I could install this to the exosuit at some point. But you know what? I haven't decided. So we're going to put it there. Pyrite's good for recharging the pulse engine. Used up. And deuterium, I don't even know. I don't even, what can you use deuterium for? I know it's to craft something. Charging upgrading. What can I what can I charge stuff with? What if I put it in there? Nothing. I think you can use the medium refiner to do something with this. Storage container. When in doubt, storage container. Actually you should be in the high capacity there. And Make the drives. Are you letting yourself make the drives? Yeah. Anything at the anything available at the anomaly, I can get. You got to, otherwise you can't you can't make all the drives. It's impossible. So any upgrade at the anomaly I can get. However, the one anomaly dude sells the C upgrades, but I can't talk to him because Discovery Services is still off. And, uh, yeah, it's, you have lost connection. It's been off since the upgrade. So. What was I doing? Starship. Anything else? Tritium's good. Uranium's good. Salvage data's good. See, one of the problems with these X upgrades is look how much space they're wasting. Uh, storage container for now. Sure. They're wasting a lot of space until I get upgrades. Alright, well... I freed up some inventory. 
I gotta take a short break to get a drink. And uh, it's I'm sure there's not gonna be any storms on this planet, so I'll just stand outside. And we can enjoy the view. Uh, like so. There we go. And uh, I will be back in uh, just uh, five minutes or less.